Get your plant. Go get the plant. I'm going to make a soothing lotion or like mist spray for me, Wes, and Lola when we get to the Bahamas out of our like essential oils and coconut oil, which we're going to use for the carrier and then for the grand finale. Hold on. I bought an organic aloe leaf um, when we were in West Palm Beach, so we can, we're gonna, what are we gonna do? We're gonna make the aloe um, lotion, right? Yeah, because show them your sunburn. Bad farmer tan. <laughs> Everyone's been teasing Wes about his sunburn since we were in like, I don't know, Maryland, so now I'm finally gonna medicate him some aloe, I guess. Gonna have some nice natural aloe for the burn. Right now we're waiting for uh, Lake Worth Avenue Bridge. On the uh, chart book it does, it does say that it is on demand for the time. However, there is construction going on and um, it's on every hour now for the construction, which is kind of ruining our whole schedule today. We've been fighting the current, and we've been uh, going against the wind. The wind's been at our nose, and the current's been at our nose, so it's a bad combo. Going about average of two knots all day long. It's pretty bad. Water says 5.9 feet of water. Online says different. We're at 9.3. Good. 7 feet Wes, the filet master, the filet fish master, is now the filet o aloe master. <laughs> it's all my experience filleting fish right here. It's for his sunburn, look at him. I got burnt bad. I, I got burnt on purpose to test out the aloe leaf. Shortly you will be reaping all of its benefits. <laughs> Like gooey. Look at that. Has anyone ever seen this? <laughs> I've never ever dealt with an aloe leaf. Tell me. Have you ever used aloe gel? Yeah. It yeah. kind of seems like the consistency of aloe gel. It is. Hey, 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 hey. No. Lola. It's bad for her. Yeah, it's toxic to dogs. It's like almost identical to flying a fish. Do 
they sell aloes back home? Mm-hmm. They do? Yeah. At our supermarket? I'm just gonna um, rinse it with some water to get this, I guess there's like a layer of like yellow slime. I kind of forget what it's called. But it acts as a laxative. Like, so look at this. This is like We exactly don't want to put like that filet. in our thing. Look in there. See this? It's like exactly like filling a fish right there. Crazy. It's like a freaking fish. Look at that, huh? The fully master over here. Oh! And he has filleted and retrieved the aloe gel. Ah! Yeah! <laughs> We're anchored here in Lantana right now. We didn't make it to our um, original anchorage we chose, which was uh, Lettuce Lake or Lake Lettuce, just north of Fort Lauderdale. Um, the current and the wind were pretty fierce today. We're going an average of two knots, sometimes slower. And, um, and so now we're right here. It says it was pretty shallow. I originally wrote down here in the notes. I'd say if you're traveling along the ICW um, and you're ever concerned about Anchorage, just Google it and you will most likely find discussions about it online and that will give you the best insight on whether or not you can go in because the GPS chart plotter said it was 5.9 feet depth here which is no good and um, the charts even show that it's really shallow so online we, uh, online we read that it was 7 to 8 feet average so we scouted the area around uh, low tide. We came in at low tide and we scouted the area, and uh, it was pretty, pretty good depth. Dropped around. that baby. And dropped that baby in the water. Looks like Kate's mashing up a bunch of jellyfish right now. Yeah. We're having jellyfish for dinner tonight. Yeah. Found a better way to squish up all this aloe gel. I'm a human blender. <laughs> Let the healing begin. For dinner tonight, we got grilled avocado and pasta chef over here starving we've never tried the grilled avocados before so hopefully those are good they look good try new things out here old Maybe food all. new way <laughs> 